Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and welcome to my graphic design channel. And if you like scary movies and Halloween like me, then let me show you today how to draw that skull in Adobe Illustrator. And at first we will create this flat illustration and then we will make have some 3D skull in seconds in Adobe Illustrator. And if you're interested in how you can make it, then keep watching. This is size of my workspace and these are colors which I'm going to use in my tutorial and if you want to take a closer look at my design and to download an original vector file with colors and my design, you can do it on my Patreon page, the link will be below this tutorial. And guys, I invite you to my Telegram channel where on Wednesday I will make a competition. And you can win prizes from me that will be useful to you in your work as a graphic designer. More on my Telegram channel. Well guys, let's start the tutorial. Hope your colors are already in the swatches panel. Let's take orange color and rectangle tool and create the rectangle like that. It will be our background. And let's lock it in the layers like this. Now let's take white color and ellipse tool and create the ellipse, ellipse with the size 388 to 388. Ok. Let's move it up. Let's take direct selection tool, select that point, move it a little down. Now select these two points and move them a little up, like that. Ok. Now let's take rectangle tool and create the rectangle with the size 108 to 202. Ok. Let's Rotate it like that. Move here. OK. Now let's uh, select again rectangle tool and create one more rectangle with the size 170 to 102. OK. Move up here. Now select that rectangle, direct selection tool, select that point and move it here, like that, and that one here, a little up this one, and uh, select this one, transform reflect vertical copy, move here. Select both shapes and align them. OK. Let's uh, move them a little like that. At first this one and now this one up and this one the same up. And now select both and align them. OK. Now take again rectangle tool and create the rectangle 40 to 55. OK. Move it here. Now select that shape. Go to Effect, Warp, Bulge and Vertical and move here minus 13, minus 17, like that. OK. And now rotate that rectangle. Move up. Uh, 
Okay, now hold Alt and make the copy, transform, reflect, vertical. Okay, move here. Make one more copy. And one more. Okay. Now let's move their teeth to make them more pretty. Like this. Let it be like this for now. Take direct section tool, select that point, hold and drag to round the corner. Now make the same. You need to make different corners and different shapes to make it more interesting. Select these two points and move them a little to the left. Now you need to select both points and round the corner. For example, select these two points, move them to the right and again select these two corners and round them like that. This corner you can round a little bigger. And the same you can round that tooth like that and select this shape and go to object expand appearance now select all these shapes and go to pathfinder unite now select the teeth and smooth tool and make these corners more smoother more rounded but we need uh, that way will be unperfect a little like this if you like, you can make here uh, the, the shape a little wider. Select the points with help of direct section tool and move them. And let's smooth here their shape with help of smooth tool. Okay. Now uh, select that shape and that corner with help of uh, direct section tool, the same here, select and round it, okay, and the same here, select and round it, like that, and the same here. Now select these three shapes, go to Pathfinder Unite, okay, now direct section tool, select these two points, and hold and drag to round them and now select uh, these two shapes pathfinder unite and direct section tool and you need to round these corners and select this round it and select this one and round it Okay, now let's take black color and uh, pencil and now let's create the eyes. Uh, let's start from here. The second point will be here. Now let's be the third point here. And let's close the path like that. If you need it, you can take a direct section tool and play with the shape or add one more point with help of a uh, pen tool with uh, plus. And play with their shape. Okay, now select the eye, move a little up, transform reflect vertical copy and move the copy here, select both eyes and align them. Okay,
let they be here now let's take a polygon tool and create the polygon with the size free with the sides free and now direct section tool around that corner now around these corners now now let's take uh add anchor point tool let's add here one point select that point and move it a little up and uh, select it and round the corner okay round that corner and this one now let's take let's make their nose uh, a little wider go to effect warp bulge and let it be 22 percent object expand appearance select the nose now make it thinner okay let's take white color and rectangle tool create the rectangle with the size 170 to 57 okay now uh, let's make the copy make it smaller shorter rotate it move here rotate like that transform a uh, reflect vertical copy move down mm, okay rotate that shape a little and this one select both shapes and group them and transform vertical copy and now select all shapes and align them upper finder unite now take dark section tool and round all corners okay the bone is ready now we need to open 3d and materials window okay and now we need to select the all details uh, of the skull and group it okay and now here we you need to go with me step by step to create a 3d icon uh, of uh, their skull uh, there is no one rule to create 3d um, icon so uh, you always need to play with options till you like the result and uh, here go with me but if you want you can uh, try your own options try to make a different skull uh, so let's go to materials now and make it more glossy with help of this option okay and now of course we need to play with lighting to create an uh, interesting view of our skull so guys and like this you can pretty fast i would say in seconds create 3d icon of uh, everything if you uh, play with options and uh, do it till you'd like the result Well guys, the skull is ready, now let's play with their bone.
if you want to make your illustration more quality, go to Effect and uh, Document Raster Effects and select here 300 and OK. OK. And now if your illustration is ready, now let's uh, unlock the layer with the background. Let's go to the layers and unlock it. OK. Now select the skull, go to Object Expand Appearance and select the bone and go to Object Expand Appearance. And now let's make our details a little bigger. OK, like this. OK. And now let's select the background, copy and paste it and send to front. Now select the whole design and make clipping mask. OK, guys, the design is ready. And that's all for today. Hope you like my tutorial. If yes, then give me a like and subscribe and have a happy Halloween. And see you in the next tutorials in Adobe Illustrator or in the next videos about graphic design. Bye bye guys. Bye.